we've got some big old moo cows here it looks like they're uh, on the road I could slap that one's eye But I did it because I'm a good boy. Oh, good morning and welcome to day four of the tour of Scotland including the NC500 and we've just left Wick and we're en route to John O'Groats which is 18 miles away. We just filled up. Uh, yeah, cracking, uh, cracking little uh, two-bedroom house we had, on the townhouse, on across three stories last night. Uh, we didn't go out. Uh, the fish and chips just down the road, by the harbour. They were lovely. Uh, we didn't go out to the pub or anything. We, uh, we had a night in and watched a bit of telly. And um, up uh, this morning again. Yesterday, total miles 246 miles we covered yesterday. I think we got about 217 to cover today. Um, it's right, it's, it's uh, sunshine forecasting week. Um, so hopefully, this rain is just, just passing through here and we'll pick up some decent weather shortly. Um, so, uh, yeah, if not, we'll done the waterproofs at, uh, at Johnny Groats. And uh, that's our first stop for the day, so we've got to go it's up to uh, across along the coast to Durness, Durness down to Ullapool and tonight's night is in Ullapool uh, at the ferry boat in. So day four, yeah, 4th of August, 22, um, and yeah, I think I summed up yesterday uh, with the video from yesterday. Uh, today, the stuff say, started a bit bleak, but then you just don't know what's in store. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, worth of the day. So I'll be back once we get up towards John O'Groats and, uh, and we'll take you from there. I'll see you shortly. Here we are, we're three miles from John O'Groats now. So uh, stay with us as we, uh, as we drop down into John O'Groats. The first for me and the boyos. None of us have been here before. I'd say uh, the John O'Groats Virgins. John O'Groats. <coughs> here we are. I haven't got my expectations. I've been told not to raise them. See you fully licensed. Oh, it's where do we park? Three pounds per vehicle per, per day. Jesus wet. <coughs> Never got a bit tired of being raped and pillaged by parking charges. I don't know, I do. Gonna go over there, Kev. So we can go over there, mate. This will do us, would he? Yeah. 
There you go, mate. I told you it was crap. Oh. I told you it was crap. Crap. Oh, no. Oh, oh, mate, mate, is that what they've done? Yeah. So that's us saying bon voyage to uh, Johnny Groats. We've all done the uh, the Johnny Groats dance of taking our pictures, taking selfies, taking pictures of each other, visiting the shop, buying souvenirs and stickers, fridge magnets, and other delightful. Out there, delightful. Uh, gifts and trinkets for our loved ones. So now our next stop is uh, Durness. Uh, we may stop on the route, I'm not sure. I'm pretty much winging this, so... Uh, 4 hours and 43 minutes of riding time we've got. And we've got the, uh, the good stuff to get through yet. So uh, that's Johnny Groats done. Day four, first stop, Jolly Groats, tick. Let's move on to the next. So, uh, see you shortly when we get into uh, something spectacular. This looks nice, doesn't it? Beautiful. Dunnit Sands. over there, two below Dimbus clouds. Oh, I'll be 
days of geography at school. I'm good at geography. Got top marks all through the uh, I chose it as an option and I got top mark all the time, top of the class for geography, did the O level and uh, failed. Didn't even get a grade, it was so bad that I got a U. Like, unclassified. I don't know what went wrong. I haven't got a clue what went wrong to this day. But I absolutely loved geography at school. My favourite subject and I excelled in them failed the O level. What a novel. Uh, hey ho. These things were probably meant to happen. Probably got something distracting me when I was six, 15. I thought I can't be bothered to do a geography out of today. Well, that's how I know about cumulo and cirrus clouds and cirrus clouds and glacial valleys and river valleys and Oxbow lakes and all that sort of stuff, you know, I used to find it absolutely fascinating. And uh, I think this here on the right is a nuclear power station. It's been decommissioned. I'm pretty sure it's a nuclear power station. I shall confirm. Just passed into the county of Sutherland. This is a, this is lovely. Beautiful stretch of uh, twisty road here. We've seen so many landscapes over the last few days. Changing landscapes is just amazing. Obligatory stopped by a sign that said he had C500 on it and uh, took a 
uh, photographs of the bikes and ourselves by the uh, by the sign. Uh, the midges were in top fighting form, so I left me rocky crash on it, and I thought I'm not standing, not having that. So uh, hopefully the other boys didn't get eaten too badly. Uh, yeah, that was a very pleasant little stop, little uh, another souvenir photograph for the trip. So, um, and that sign was 133 miles to Waterpool. So, uh, and, we're, uh, and we're 57 miles in, and we're not going directly to Waterpool, so it's going to be a bit, uh, bit detouring away probably. So, uh, what a wonderful, wonderful. Just, just an absolute pleasure, joy to do. And the weather looks like it's going to be kind to us for the rest of the day, hopefully. Mountains over there in the distance. Right over there. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So, I'm ready to that we don't cars ruining our vista. Awesomeness take in in one year. Phew, just love it. Hello, cows.
we appear to have ourselves a little bridge. Awesome. Just beautiful. I can see why you're walking, geezer. do something in your life and you just don't want it to end. So trips like this, it's for me. Never want them to end, especially when it's like this. Just do this all day long, every day. I would never get bored. Big old moo cows here. It looks like they're uh, on the road. I could slap that one's ass. But I did it because I'm a good boy. Look at the bloody vista here again. <laughs> oh God, man. back a little bit but bloody hell
yes, 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 yes. 